Hello everybody, this is Taylor with FTC Gaming Community coming at you again with another video, but this time an updated video on how to put an Exile server at your house. So, first thing you want to do is step one is install MySQL. And I will put a link in the description, but as you can tell, it's right here. I'll put this link in here for Windows. I have Windows 10, so anybody else has that? Well, who doesn't have Windows 10? Well, yeah, I guess you're going to have to do something else. So we're going to click on this to install it. So it does take quite a bit of time, doesn't it? I'm going to pause the video until it's ready. Oh, here we go. We want to accept the terms. We want to go full oops do you wish to continue? yes I want to continue we're going to execute this so we can install it all I'm going to go ahead and pause the video because this does take quite a bit of time all right everything's installed so click next click next to confirm we want this to be a server machine everything is fine there now type in whatever password you want for this then you want to add a user I'm just going to put my name in here. Go down to password. And just type in my test password. Yeah, I know it's weak. And then we click next. Startup system, standard account. Custom user, existing users can exist. In a, no, everything else is fine. No, don't care about that. Now execute. Now I'm going to pause the video while this is doing its thing. Alright, as you can tell, everything's done. So now we click finish and then next. And then you want to click check, connection successful click next and now it's gonna start server stop server all that good stuff now while this is doing that I'm gonna just hit pause alright now that's done we hit finish and then next yes we want to start it up alright when you get to this part of the the screen what you want to do is minimize go to here I'll put it over here my PC or however you want to get to it go to manager because you want to go to services go to services now scroll down until you find my SQ L57 then what you want to do is stop it and then you want to minimize that open up your PC which sorry open up on another screen go to C Drive then if your stuff is hidden what you want to do is go to view and make sure hidden items is clicked to show them then you want to go down to program data 
scroll down until you see MySQL MySQL 57 and then click on mine and I use notepad plus plus so then you want to scroll all the way down until you see this part right here then you want to delete everything inside the quotation marks and then save it I don't know why it's saying I'm not admin I must have not activated it okay save it close it you can go ahead and close this now then go back to your computer manager and now restart MySQL and you should get a notification saying that it's from stop to running and now you don't need this so go ahead and close this now that you are here I have already downloaded you know everything you need to download and I will put a link to all of this in here and I will also have put in my drop I think it's called Dropbox I think it's called this and this these are two different this is a different way of installing you know your server so what you want to do next is right click extract it because you want right here so go here click here let's save that bad boy to vault so I don't have to ask for it no more now right here you want to right click and then drop them <clears throat> now hit refresh now hit create right click on it create now we're going to name this exile apply apply again and now finish then you can close this close this now if you know exactly where this file is all you gotta do is go to where it has the SQL plus sign go there open the folder and then go to your downloads folder here here exile now there's one thing you 100% got to remember to do you got to make sure this is highlighted black like it is then come back over here and then hit execute and if everything's done right you shouldn't have any problem as you can tell everything green check marks so come back over here hit refresh and as you can tell everything is there now just to double check here's my username and password for everything all right now that's done your database server is all set ready to go so thanks for watching I will upload this like I said I'll also put the stuff you need and the download links in the description thanks for watching